a deal that Local 79 can recommend our members support is a deal that doesn't take hundreds if not thousands of dollars out of our members pockets our frontline workers pockets to pay for unneeded cuts to benefits a part of a good job I would characterize ourselves as still being far apart on some of the key issues the concessions that we've been talking about no I'm not discouraged I'm not discouraged I'm not discouraged because uh, I know from uh, from polling that's been done that that Toronto residents understand it's okay for a union to bargain to protect parts of good jobs those are benefits those are sick leave provisions and those are decent predictable hours of work I would love if we could reach a deal my midnight but if we don't let's keep negotiating yeah. and if the city threatens to impose terms and conditions of employment uh, we'll look at our options that we're prepared for Do you feel continue to talk so we are not focusing on service disruption we're focusing on negotiations we'll continue to do that past 1201 we'll continue to do that throughout the weekend and into the days following if it takes that